Hello guys, hello guys and welcome to the channel. Today we're going to be talking about Uhe Pichele, you know, former Orlando Pirates player. Hi, he's a legend, this one. This one is a legend. And also coach Orlani Mokwena, who responds to being taken to court by Usid Ramovic or Itilek TS Galaxy. Uhe Pichele reveals that he was close to joining KZ Chiefs, very, very close. But they were too slow and Orlando Pirates came and they took him. You know, you know, you know how the Iron Duke works, guys. He says, Guti, I was supposed to sign for Kaiser Chiefs. Mr. Bobby Mutaung was slow and Pirates came and I signed. You know, this is what he told uh, MSL uh, Marawa. Uh, I was in their camp and training at the Chiefs village. I was looking forward to playing for Kaiser Chiefs at the time. But Pirates came quickly and signed. You know, you get that, guys. So Kaiser Chiefs was very slow in their approach and... Pirates moved and I see uh, Makuena says which it was a good choice for Chiefs because they also could do, they also had a good defense at that time, you know. So yeah, man, um, it was a good choice it turns out because he joined Pirates and ever since he's played, he's made more than 400 appearances and like I said, for me personally, ah guys, come on, Happy Jelly is a legend and I've said it which after his retirement, I saw him saying that he's not going to play football again. I'm hoping good he uh, you know, even that position that they offered him at first, the non-playing uh, position, maybe uh, I hope that it's still in offer because I would love to see him coming back to Pirates Mina personally. Like I said before, I love it when it's players that are passionate about the game and they know the team and the culture and everything else. Let us jump quickly to Coach Orlan Mugwena and what did he say about what is his reaction to being taken to court by ets galaxy he says which it is nothing much really that i can say you know about the game i'm not in uh, involved uh, in football for these types of matches so i don't want to speak too much about the match you know there were many incident uh tash you know the first half there was a clear penalty so he's also complaining about the clear penalty and he also now touches on the court, the issue of the court, you know, uh, we will meet in court, really. So, so I don't want to talk about anything. They have taken it to court, so let us meet in court. This is what he said when he was asked about the accusations that he made about the Zumu tackle before saying that he cannot focus on the feud and what it has cost of late. He says that I don't worry about Test Galaxy. You know, I have to worry about Sundowns. I'm implored by Sundowns. I have to. And at this moment, even with the feelings I have, I have to be very proud of my players because it was a difficult them game for them to play. And he says we will meet in court because that's how far you guys have taken it. So guys, what do you think? Do you think it was a good thing for Chess Galaxy to now take the issue to court? Couldn't they fix it for now? privately internally but ish when you look at those statements that we made ish i can't blame them you know because ish ah guys that one is above you know i know that they always throw jabs at each other but the one of saying that uh test galaxy or the coach told his players to go and injure the sundowns player i feel like that one hey it was it was too much so i don't blame them for going to court you know